everybody and welcome back to episode 2 of Emma Plays Game of Thrones uh, Episode 1 of Telltale's series last time um, It was pretty much Emma fucked up and everyone died But that's common for Game of Thrones So we're just going through the cool title sequence now um, Obviously I think if you're watching this you've probably seen the show So you've seen this title sequence before this is really interesting how they've adapted this to like to be the actual game. This is actually really interesting and pretty. And that place is not in the show, so it's fucking good. Uh, I miss seeing that on TV all the time. I need to go watch the series again. Um, so we obviously I think we just played the prologue of this episode um, so I'm from ice uh, let's sort of bring it on let's cross our fingers people get laid and drink alcohol so for we're in the forest of lands yeah, on the King's Road everyone knows you shouldn't actually travel on the King's Road if people are after you but hey you know this guy's who knows bit hungry. He loves bacon, so should be grabbing that bacon. Alright, we're just chilling. Walking around. Alright, come on, can we kill the piggy? No? There's some blood there. Surprise, surprise! Blood in Game of Thrones, you would have thought. Ew, mate. I can have, like... You don't know what fucking diseases that blood has, man. Wash your hands. Oh, it's probably from the pig. R.I.P. pig. It's not the last death that we'll see in this game. Not at all. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Can we have a look at this wagon? Nope. Alrighty. Let's head up this way. Whoa. Okay, that was a bit of a jump. Who could do that to that That's car? Father's car. <laughs> oh, okay. Fucking this guy is just gonna be. This is like gonna be a repeat of the stocks. Where everyone's gonna die. Mate. Mate. It's a bolt. Come on, boy. There's nothing for you here. Father. I said move on. Unless you want to get fed to the fucking pigs. I recognize you. You're a forester squire. Former Stark bannermen have no claim on land anymore. Mm. I haven't you Whoop. heard? The Starks are dead. Where'd you get that sword? Wouldn't Not you like to know? That sword is his. Must have stolen it. Out here by himself. Probably a deserter. Ah, I killed a man for it. Did you? Okay, oh, maybe we weren't that convincing to be scary just then. That sword's too big for you, boy. You can barely pick it up. Get off. My land! This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new warden mm, of the north. I the Bolton. Like like Are they an interesting bunch? <gasps> I need to stop talking. <laughs> I'll have that sword, boy. Fuck. <laughs> You. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I had to. <coughs> oh, no. Oh, okay. That was maybe a dumb move. Alright. Finish this fucking pig farmer. Pathetic. That guy's beard is. Surely they don't have that much time to, like, stylize their beards. They are a pig. <laughs> Go 
in the face. Alrighty, so let's, let's get this. Tackled. Fuck. Q, 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 Q. E. I hate playing with a keyboard. I should probably stick in my um PlayStation controller next time. Oop. Mercy, please. I beg of you. I, I have a family. They'll never survive without me. I have no quarrel with you. That was actually that was a really bad move. Shouldn't have done that. Thank you. I always like default to being nice in these games, but I forget this is fucking Game of Thrones. Like, if you're nice, if you're nice, you fucking go home. But at least he ran away. All right, let's go see how our old father is going. Father? Father? Garrett, you survived. How did he not see that whole fight? Like, bro, were you not Your watching? Oh, she hid. Oh. Well, that, that sucks. I tried to stop them. Oh, jeez. He's seen enough death, man. I'll kill the men who did this. We will. Don't worry, we will. Alrighty. I want to know if we actually play as a different character. I hope we do. Iron Wrath. Nope. I want to play as a chick that I've seen in the trailer. It's Garrett! Oh, Garrett has returned! Get the Castellan! Tell him his nephew hey, survived! Garrett. <laughs> well, at least people are happy to see him. I mean, he's pretty fucked, but Can hey. Does that not remind dead. you of like Jon Snow? He's always falls back in bloody. Bring the master. <laughs> Meet us in Castle the Black. Hall. Quickly. All right, let's see what's happening with the master. Well, that's cute. Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. Those Boltons. They killed my family. And for what? Out of all the houses, the Boltons my are sister, the worst. Like, way worse than any house that you old. can think of. The Boltons. This never would have happened with the Starks fuck you in up. power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank mm. you, Mister. I do like the sigil. Of Fast mm, Forester. Blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Ooh. Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. It was justice. They got what they deserved. They did indeed. Justice. I love you can't how let they the talk. Just walk all over us. <laughs> These maggots ought to help prevent infection. Hold Maggots. the window open for me, would you? Maggots? Oh. Oh. Yuck, that's the worst thing I've ever seen on Game of Thrones. These are dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. I suppose that's what people had to do, but the fucking maggots. In times such as this, the late Lord Forrester was a good man, and poor Roderick, a serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Our house will never fall. By the gods, let's hope you're right. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now, although he is young and altogether unprepared How to How old is Lord Ethan? Right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Hold this for me, will you? I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. 
Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Putting him Roderick down. couldn't handle himself. Uh. He's as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of Warcraft. Roderick had already fallen. There was nothing we could do. Mm. Well, I, I love their accents. I'm going to say that the whole entire time. anyone from his house. I all know. I lived in England Lady for Forrester a bit, so <laughs> English I'd accents. I'd like you to walk for me first, to see if you can put any weight on that leg. Full with maggots. Man, you ain't gonna get laid with maggots in your leg. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. Look at the Lord's chair. Fancy. Not as cool as a throne. Like, I want to be sitting on the throne, man. Where is Cersei? The Ironwood Grove. Alright. Well, he can walk. He's got maggots in his leg. He ain't going to be fighting for a while, I don't think. That's cute. I want a picture like that. Uh. Still in King's Landing, I suppose. Although, I wonder if they'll bring her home. Mm. Forester. She's always been kind to me. Treated me like I was a forester myself. Do you reckon that they've tried to sort of create the Starks in a different... Like family, Talia and Ethan. I suppose Lord Ethan now. Like Ryan. They've got Never quite a bit of fourth-born son. Bit of people. Lord Forrester. It was an honor to squire. Like for that's him. totally Ned. Gregor the Good. Roderick. Roderick. He was our best warrior by far. And that was like Rob. Okay. I might learn more about that mm. later, but not on. Favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. On I'm fine. Mess screen. Right Look, I'll show you. We're just like looking at all these things. Let's touch the bucket. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? Ew. No. Yes. No. That's fucking gross. Got some weed, the healing herbs. This might help. <laughs> Thieving the weed? Alright, let's talk to the maester. And get out of here. Oh, uh, let's show him the sword first. You know. Nah, he doesn't look impressed. It's a good thing you've done, bringing that back to House Forrester. By right, that belongs to Lord Ethan now. That sword has been handed down through 50 generations of Foresters. Aw, see, it's, it's like ice. They're totally, like... They're trying to make this like the Starks, I reckon. Feel weak? No. I just wanted to ask you. Um... Why do I the white hate the foresters? Know. I think it's safe to say the feeling is mutual. There's been enmity between the two houses for as long as anyone can remember. I don't doubt someone killed someone, which led to more killings of someone's, and then, well, here we are. Classic Game of Thrones. Um. Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Any time will tell, but. Lady Forrester. Hello. Welcome home, Garrett. We're all relieved to know you survived. Like, Thank as you. if that's not Catelyn. Talia asked to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? Your family... Aww. I'm so sorry. Nato. Off to bed now. Hurry on. 
Well, is there a thing going on there? Garrett was just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester so. fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. He loved his family, my lady. He was very proud of Roderick. Yet he was unable to save him. Family first. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything, he... He fought valiantly, my lady. Of course he did. He was half That's what they care best. about in this. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was Poor told... Girl. I was told you were the, the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last words before he passed? He mentioned something about the North Grove. The North Grove? What of it? He said, the North Grove must never be lost. I revealed my North secret. Grove. Interesting. I mean, I don't think I she's going to betray us. You have the Forester's sword. Because he was supposed to tell... This belongs with Ethan now. Oh, no. He's the new lord Whoops. Whoops. Thank this you. is just going to be a whole Dad. thing of fuck-ups. But let's see how bad we can do this. It a response. It's too dangerous, especially now. Now is the time to prove our strength. I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. Maybe the mace no, is going to betray us? our land. They were our people. Your family. I share your outrage, Sir Royland. I do. But now is not the time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see Ooh, us. Oh, Ramsay. The hell with Ramsay Snow, the bastard. Garrett, you uh, understand. You don't want to fuck a Ramsay. Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. We're the ones that should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. They attacked me. And they'll say they were keeping the peace in the name of House Bolton. It's an argument you cannot win. We have to be smart. I Ramsay Snow will be lot. here within the week. I need and to would get you? in the mindset of being Nothing. like more bitchy. I think. While they're still attached to our shoulders. Garrett has lost as much as anyone else within these walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett suffered enough already. You asked too much of the boy. He deserves to be heard. You need My to be smart right. in Game of Thrones. We need to be smart. Smart. Edward Stark was smart. And no, Edward Stark him. was not smart. So, what's to be done? <laughs> Edward was an idiot. Let's <sighs> say that straight up. Ultimately, it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the you Lord know nothing, house, John Snow. And he needs our help. It's bad enough the Bolton's have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this. What? I'll accuse you of murder and us of protecting you. The boy was just mm. defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he did. It wasn't murder. It murder. was justice. Not in their eyes. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like oh, to see no. them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take, which is why you cannot stay. Cannot stay? Duncan? Where but would I go? Where would I go? The one place beyond the reach of even House Bolton. No, not the wall. You're sending him to the wall? Oh. The boy's done nothing How's he gonna get laid now? I'm afraid it's the only solution. Uncle. My place is here. Who would defend the house? I ain't gonna walk. said we need men who can fight. There'd be nothing we could do to protect you. To stay would bring destruction upon us all. I know that's not what you want. I know it's difficult to understand. But you must think of the house. I won't put others at risk. I'll go. I know it doesn't seem Remember fair, your bravery. It is what's best. The wall... That settles it then. You bloody maggot you leg. You horse. ain't gonna get laid. And I'll see you have plenty of food, but we haven't much time. The White Hills will come looking Hanging out with Jon Snow. Actually, in this point of time in the books and the show are different. At this point in time, I don't think Jon Snow is back at the wall yet. Anyways. 
this seems like a good place as any to end the episode. Thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you again next episode. Bye!